Oh yeah, my mom's got a YouTube channel, and this is uh, this is her theme song for it. <laughs> Coffee Colts and Crafts, by the way. <laughs> Shout out to mom. <laughs> All right. You guys ready? Do it up. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm so excited that you're all here. Thank you for joining me for the second installment of a little series that I'm calling the Cult Leaders Toolbox, where we explore different tactics that cults use to captivate their followers and in many cases to hold them captive. That Bob Ferris will see this. That is my hope. I hope that so too. Day he will watch this and see how much love there is from everybody. People that are never and in. And I'm a person. Right. The never ends. Like, thank you. So I'm looking above, like, it's the Brady Bunch connection. Um, it's, you know, the amount of love is astronomical. Um, the support has been amazing. And it, it made a person that never thought they'd stand up and fight be like, all right, my feet are planted. Let's go. Oh, now, Marilyn, I'm excited because you didn't, you weren't raised in Scientology and you are well versed in cults, but I tried, tried to be tricky. I'm sure you'll stump me plenty. Again, the same playbook. It always plays out the same way, even though we're talking about two apparently totally different things. But again, we had the tech and yours was just the faith. I just want to point that out. Okay. It was scientific, don't you know? <laughs> like just throw a roast pigeon in there. Nobody will notice. What the frick is no. the roast pigeon for? So in the army, I'm referred to as an SP. For real. Wow. Which is hilarious. You're used, yeah. you're used to that then. <laughs> wow. so I'm like, you guys have no idea. <laughs> been nesby for a long time welcome to the dung heap i have been dying to visit the dung heap i feel like it's been forever i am thrilled I to be here at the dung heap <laughs> the comments in the live chat right now are I, i'm not even looking i'm just pretending <clears throat> i'm in my living room or i'm in my little spot talking to aaron <laughs> oh my god are you okay <laughs> like we say same shit different air freshener it's giving the same the same vibes the same outcomes the same control everything at the expense of integrity at the expense of advocating for those most vulnerable which again are the kids breaking news for all the people that want to really go save shelly the literal jelaine maxwell of david miscavige does not need Saving. She needs to be questioned by the FBI in a serious way. She needs to start confessing to every child she literally knows. Underage kid was put not in the hole, in the RPF. Because that's what Shelly Miscavige is personally responsible for. But our office has determined that she is in fact legally blonde and thus is fully qualified to present evidentiary evidence as well as evidence-based evidence and of repetitive and redundant redundancies and to expose said, said redundant redundancies as may be required for your education and edification. So please be advised that Marilyn is not responsible for anyone's misinterpretation or misapplication of any of the evidence-based evidence or redundant redundancies that she may have presented or is presenting presently or may present in the future.